guys already know. Oh my god. <laughs> I have to kick my feet real quick. Oh my god. Because nice Betty story. was about to get left in a major way. <laughs> so guys, I'm sitting here editing the video and I realized that something happened to the audio whenever we got off the elevator and I don't even want to kill your guys' ears with it. So anyways it's going down in a major way y'all already know and we're going to um our friend's birthday party the baby is turning one super cute mickey mouse party and i'm gonna just like fast forward through this part so that you guys can see but i don't know what the heck happened to the audio guys Ooh. family so we are back and as you can tell we keep getting a lot of packages and you're not allowed to look over there buddy because that one's for you but um our uber eats is actually on its way here um braylon ate a lot at the party but i didn't eat anything at the party except for some snacks so i'm really hungry and um i want to take you guys upstairs to see what we have in kaden's room now kaden come show everybody your room come on he has a big boy surprise to show you guys. Come, oh, boom, oh my gosh. Kaden, you have to come here. I don't even know if a lot of you guys have ever been in Kaden's room. Braylon's following me, I don't know what he's doing. Hi, I'm just doing the journey. He's joining the journey, okay. So, pretty much, Kaden has a new thing in his room. And if a lot of you guys have been following for a while, you know that Kaden sleeps in our I already know what it is. Bed. Braylon already knows what it is. So, look at this. Look at this. This, right here, is a baby monitor. Because he's been in our room for far too long, Beverly Hall family. So, <laughs> I had to get them tips. I had to get them tips. So pretty much, it is like remote control, and it goes up and down, and we can now put him in his bed, and Marco and I can have our bed back. Praise the Lord. Oh. Praise the Lord. So that is the new update of what's going on inside of Caden's room. So yes, I'm not even sure if many of you guys have even seen Caden's room. It was really dirty and we finally cleaned it today. But um, I am actually going to just do kind of like a nighttime routine. You guys already seen it the other day. And I'm gonna get things settled down because I have a lot of work I need to do before Monday morning. I have tons of deliverables. Um, if you guys know we're like content creators full time so that's what we do we work with brands that we love and we had to film tons of content this weekend which pushed us really behind on everything but Caden's over here really fascinated with his sound machine oh. what do you think about that <laughs> that's really cool huh it sounds like water do you like your room? Because you're never in here. We got fuzzies on. Look, he's trying to get out. Where are you going? Where are you going? Oh, oh. Where are you going? You want to help mommy go get the food? Let's go get the food. That's a vacuum. Nothing cool there. Bang, boop. That is the Uber delivery. You want to try some new food? So I just watched this really eerie Facebook video. <laughs> Creeped me out about this man that did some really bad things. And I'm like creeped out now about opening my door because the way he did it was like 
pretended like he was going to go like drop his kids off and then he like hurt the wife terribly bad like so now I'm like freaking out because I got to go into the door and I feel like you never know people's intentions you know it's a creepy story I feel bad rest in peace to all three people He's still out there. Like, why? He needs to just leave. You can leave. Babe? He's still just like outside of our freaking door. Okay. We have lots of things to see. This. Oh, thank you, Kaden. And we also have some drinks. And then we also have a lot of we also have a lot of water out there, but I'm not gonna get it right now. So, okay, bub, let's shut the door. I'm sorry, this is so long. But we're eating Arby's tonight. You just know there's food here, don't you? You wanna go tell everybody it's time to eat? See, your food is here. Boys, the food's here. Come eat. I know everyone loves to judge me for not cooking, but I do cook sometimes. You guys seen it in a previous video. It's just a little bit of a rare occasion when it happens. So it's not something I'm entirely proud of. It's just what we have to deal with right now until we get to a point in our lives where we can be more health conscious, which I feel like is going to be in 2021 because I've been starting on this app and all right. <laughs> mm. As I eat my fried food. Hey, Dan. He's always stealing Christmas presents from under the tree. Hayden. It's not Christmas yet, dude. Boy, what are you doing? Give me that present. Yeah, you got some paper. Yeah, Did you eat some paper? Hayden. Oh, I see it came out. Dude, you ate the wrapper off the present. <laughs> oh, oh, it doesn't want to leave either. Oh! Use a handful. Dude. Quit oh being bad. So, Marco and Braylon both got barbecue wings. We got Arby's. Some people say that they don't eat Arby's. We eat Arby's. I don't know why anybody canceled Arby's because I'm all about it. And then I got these jalapeno cheddar bites. 2022 is going to be my year, guys. I just am believing it because things are going to slow down in January and it's going to give us some time to just let our wings flow. Right, babe? I doubt it. We're going to get healthy in January. You're going to get healthy. I'm already healthy. I'm healthy too. Believe it or not, I am very healthy. I'm very active. I'm constantly using my brain. I think that my brain is about to give out though. No way. Yeah, it is. Don't let them fool you. I, I literally feel like my brain is gonna explode most days. Then we went to a birthday party today. I have social anxiety. I know that's probably hard for a lot of you guys to believe because I'm in front of so many of you, but being in front of people like in real life and being in front of them on the internet is like two totally different things. So you gotta be like that or you never have you can't be like that you gotta be social dude you gotta be i am social babe but well this week you being like that i'm just very reserved you know what i mean like i like to feel things out i've always been that way since i was little i've no, just been wasn't. shy no i was very outgoing but i've always been like shy around people that i don't know you know what, what i mean shy for i don't know i just get shy like i feel like i have to feel out situations before i can fully like Unwind. Boys, come eat! What do you think about that? 
I love that Mickey Mouse birthday party. Thank you for taking me. Oh, you're so welcome. You're so welcome, Cam. You know you can never eat in front of this big fat man without giving him something. So Beverly Hall family, that concludes Vlogmas Day 12. It was a slow one for us. It's our Sunday, guys. We love you so much, and we will see you on Vlogmas Day 13. Peace.